Yo, what's up, everybody? This is Fred Rec. I'm coming live and direct from the Talk Star Labs. <laughs> Whoa! Shit, my ears. Are... Yeah. <laughs> see what's cool with the lights? You get a little activation. Mm -hmm. You hit it too, mm -hmm. so people see that you're actually doing something with this. Goddamn! This motherfucker's making some heavy talk vibes. This motherfucker is making some heavy talk vibes. I'm gonna turn the edge mm -hmm. down now. I need to the intro, smooth it out so you can do some computer love. Computer love. Yeah. Oh shit. The fights. Let's go up. Let's hear that go. Shit, that shit. That shit. Shit, my fucking brain is <laughs> scrambling your brain. This shit's vibrating through my whole body. This is the greatest talk box I've ever heard now. I never used them before. I always used a, a banshee. And oh, before on. that, before yeah. that I had a um I had this, Hyle, the I had a high off from I mean, a long time ago yeah, yeah. and then I had did a session with Roger and he had this other thing that he had it was just it was just a the driver university, with university a driver or no, something. It was just a driver. Yeah, yeah. With it had a big capacitor soldered on the back. Yep, yep. And and we just plugged it into a guitar amp. Yep. yep. And then and then it, the like the, the the capacitor broke off, the solder broke off and fell or something. So he, that I, whole he kept, house, I kept yeah. it. I still have it at my house. Oh shit. And then uh, and then I just got the banshee because you don't want to lug around that amp. No, no. Sold. No. So, <laughs> so there it is. Official. That shit's fucking crazy, bro. You have to play with the moon. Uh, I use I use mine. You got the Model D. Little, I got a little fatty. I used a to little use fatty, the Model yeah. D, but yeah. now just to lug it around, I just have them. I didn't think fatty. it would be a difference. I would use DX100, or I have the Mini Nova now. They, and I see. I, I know Roger used right. to use a DX100 when he was on tour. But he originally was using the a Model mini D. Yeah, yeah, he used a, a, a Mini Move. But he so, probably got sick of lugging that thing around. But I didn't. Did, can you make the same sound? That the, I mean, he did. It's it's different. It's a totally different sound. You can hear it. He started recording with it on the later albums, but it's not the same because when I borrowed his sub thirty seven to do my album, it just was a night and day. And you can really hear the difference on this as opposed to like a bow. You're gonna do with a banshee in a movie. He's fucking flatten that bitch out. Mm -hmm. So you know you can really let this the fatness of the of the move really shine. Um, I, I love it. Like, it's really all I want to use. Yeah, I don't tell everybody that. I'm like, you know, go figure it out. <laughs> hey, man, what do you use for the talk box? <laughs> a talk box. <laughs> what keyboard do you use? What keyboard do you got? I got a record. I'm trying, I'm trying to. Yeah, I, I, I mean, I, 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 I used to... If you want to learn how to do it, go do some research, man. Go watch some videos. Go Google some shit. Go see what he we did. You know, it's fucked up. So when we were probably starting time to do talk box, they didn't have... You couldn't go on YouTube and, like, figure everything out. I'm going to tell you, you know, <laughs> I figured out how to do it because I used to listen to the records. I used to DJ at this club in the daytime. I mean, and I went there in the daytime one day to get my check. Yeah. And Roger was performing that night. So I went in the daytime and he was doing a sound check. So I was sitting there watching him, yep. and when he was done, he was really nice. And I went up to him and said, "Hey, I'm, you know, I'm DJ here tonight. You know, I'm gonna be opening up for you DJing." He was like, "Oh, okay, great, yeah." I was like, "Hey, um, can I ask you a question?" He was like, "Yeah." I was like, "Yo, what, what sound do you make those bass sounds with?" Right, right. You know what I'm saying on the right. records. He was like, "You want to see?" I was like, "Yeah." So he took me outside, and he had his bus out there, and in the yep. back of his bus, he had a little studio. And nice. he had the move out there. Yep. I mean, I, I knew he did a talk box because I seen him 
performance. Sounds yeah. You know, and I asked him when he had a guitar shop, you know, like, hey, what's this sound? And he's like, oh, that's a talk box. And then they had the heel one. Yep. But it sounded like shit. Yep. So I was like, yo, what is, how do you make those sounds? And then he had the move, the move, he lifted up the thing. Yep. And I was like, what the fuck is that? And I was just, he started playing it, and then he started doing the talk about shit. I said, it changed my life. I walked out of, off of that bus that, that day, and I was like, damn, I should have asked him, where the fuck do I get you? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You feel well, yeah. And I just want to thank my homeboy Fingers for making this incredible talk box. I mean, this thing is incredible. I never heard any talk box like that. I'm not bullshitting. I'm so happy to have one. I can't wait to go record with it. And, um, if you don't have one, and you play the talk box, or you like the sound of the talk box, don't waste your time. Get this right here. This is real quality stuff. You know what I mean?